The sound of gunfire and explosions rocked the Mexican capital in the early hours of Friday morning, when gunmen wielding high-caliber weapons attacked Mexico City's police chief. The head of public security in Mexico City was wounded, and there are other deaths in this attack. All of this has to do, without a doubt, with the work being carried out to guarantee peace and security. Authorities have confirmed that at least two police officers were killed in the shootout, as well as one bystander. Mexico City's Justice Department has confirmed 12 arrests. I feel confident the investigation will yield results to find those responsible for ordering this act of aggression. At least six criminal groups are known to operate within Mexico City. In a tweet following the attack, the city's police chief placed the blame on the Jalisco New Generation Cartel. The Jalisco New Generation Cartel is one of the most powerful drug cartels in the region and was only recently identified as having a presence within the limits of Mexico City. The shootout in the Mexican capital is only the latest incident of mass violence in the country. On Wednesday, 16 people were killed in a gunfight between rival drug gangs in the Mexican state of Sinaloa. On Monday, 15 were killed following an attack on an indigenous village in the state of Oaxaca. Despite the ongoing coronavirus outbreak, battles over control of drug territory have not lessened. Manuel Rapalo, Al Jazeera, Mexico City.